Hi, Mark Warnke here with PackOats.com. Um, this is just an opportunity to teach you something that I do every time after I get done packing in with the goats is I really pay attention to them. One of the ways you're going to know if you have poor saddle fit or it just wasn't on him right or, or that sort of thing is that you're going to see swirls in their hair and I want to give you an example of what that looks like. Now, what happened on this particular circumstance is all my boys went in yesterday and the day before and the day before with my wife and they had kind of a, a rookie crew of people putting saddles on and what happened is with Noah, they just didn't get the cinch tight. She actually, she got home, I said, hey, I see that Noah's got some you know it looks like had some saddle fit issues by based on his hair did something happen and she said yeah now that you mentioned it it did i went over and checked him after the trip out about halfway i noticed his saddle looked loose and it was super loose his cinch wasn't tight and it was you know just out of position so she put it back in position and tightened it down so what what happens and you'll also notice this just no matter even if you put the saddle on perfectly with a poorly fitting saddle this is what you're going to see so i'm going to show you this with uh with noah so what you're going to notice is that see how his hair is kind of swirled right here and then it's also right here see how it's all jumbled up that is a sign that that saddle wasn't on him right and that's where the pressure point was and it was obviously sliding forward and moving and again it was because he didn't have good cinch pressure so I just kind of wanted to give you that as an example you should always inspect your goats when you pull the saddles off of them because their hair will tell you how good the fit was um, the other neat thing in this is that our new saddle that that, that we put together has had the best hair patterns I've ever seen on any saddle I've ever used before. I'm so excited about the fit that we are getting, but even with a custom fitted saddle to a goat, without proper cinch pressure, that thing's gonna move forward and back and create a problem. And she said it was literally the person who put it on them just, you gotta remember that a goat as they pack with you, you pack them in the morning before they've eaten, they're smaller in diameter than the afternoon. So every time you put that saddle on, you have to readjust that cinch. It's not like the cinch is always the same to every goat. You cinch, then you check pressure, then you tighten it, that sort of thing. So that's just the thing that got neglected. Not uncommon for a newer person that doesn't know, and lots of times we have people help with the saddles, but we forget to check every single goat and stuff like that. So stuff like that just can happen, happens us too. So hope that helps. PackGoats.com.